Hey guys, it's How to Tech Simplified, and in this easy tutorial, I will be showing you how to actually uh, fix the Roblox error code zero. Now, this is an authentication field on Windows. It's a very easy and common fix, so let's get straight into it. The first thing that you want to try is actually reboot your system. So simply restart your Windows laptop or computer. Now, if this doesn't work, you can head down to the router, the Wi-Fi, of your house and simply unplug the router and do a hard reset this will actually reset the uh, network status for your windows computer and from here it will most likely fix the issue if this still didn't fix the issue let's get right into the next step that you can take now the next step that you can take is simply by going to the uh, search bar right here and type in windows update settings now from there we go to the windows update settings and here as you can see there is a restart required that uh, as you can see there's a load of updates pending in my windows software so simply update all your windows packages and from there restart your computer if this still didn't work what you could also do is head down to uninstall add or remove programs right here in the settings and you can reinstall a Roblox. Now from there, what we will do is go to Roblox. Now we will search for the latest Roblox. Here, delete the versions that you are using. So let's say a Roblox player here, uninstall the program. And what you will do next is simply head down to the Google Chrome browser or the browser that you prefer, type in Roblox. Head down to the official website I'm using Firefox and from here you simply head down to a game that you like simply log into your account in the top right corner from there I choose the game of your liking and what you will do next is find the big green play button press it and it will actually ask you to install a Roblox player now this makes sure that you're running the latest software available for Roblox what also could be an issue is the temporary files uh, in your computer of Roblox. Now let's say we want to find them, all you have to do is go to the start icon, right click it and from there press run. Now once you're in the run folder, simply type in percentage, app, data, percentage. This is very important that you choose this one. Simply press OK. Now what this will do is we'll open up all the temporary files on our computer. All we have to do is go to app data and from there go to local. And from here, go to a random folder, press it once, and type in an R. This will automatically take you to the Roblox folder. Now, from here, what you will do is right-click it. And as you can see, it's full of local storage and stuff that we don't need. All we do is right-click it and delete the folder right here. Now, what this will do, it will delete all the temporary files on your Roblox that you don't need. Now, what also can be a, a valid option that messes with your system is the Roblox server status. So simply open up your browser and Google server status Roblox. Now this will take you to the official status of the Roblox servers. Now as you can see it's updated a few seconds ago. The servers, the systems are all operational. And here you see the status history. Now here was a server disruption on October the 22. So you can check if it's a server related issue. Now if it's a server related issue you should need to be patient and just wait till the servers are back online. Now if you still get any questions regarding your error and if it still didn't fix your error please leave it in the comments and I will try to help you. If this tutorial helped you please leave a like, subscribe and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.